cyber stalked and what are some of the things that stalkers do? So a stalker can uh, use GPS or other sorts of electronic devices to track where your location is and where you're traveling. Cyber stalkers can post information about you or spread rumors about you all over the internet, on your social media accounts. They can hack your email um, and spam people that you know. They can even create accounts to impersonate you. It's really easy just to use like your Facebook friend list to reach out to people who know you. The perpetrator can go to the victim and say, why were you at the Brooklyn Bowl? So what are some of the things you can do to help protect yourself? So one of the most valuable things you can do is change your passwords often and try not to use the same password on multiple websites. Or say you are posting where you are, maybe post it 20 minutes after you leave. So you can turn off the different uh, location uh, services on, uh, especially like your phone, but even things that you might not suspect like your laptop, your tablet, or your camera changing location settings on and privacy settings on your social networks and then also uh, keeping details about your plans private. No matter how cute your driver's license picture is, it has a lot of private information on there so you might want to be careful about posting a picture of it on Instagram. What is one of the most surprising things you've heard about stalking? That one in seven victims of stalking actually relocate as a result of their victimization. Over 66 percent of stalking cases is someone that the victim knows. It becomes more violent when the person starts threatening themselves. One in eight employed stalking victims lose time from work. Two-thirds of stalkers pursue their victims at least once a week, many daily, using multiple methods. There's specific spy software that allows people to listen in on active calls, to read your uh, text messages, to access files on your phone or computer, uh, even to look at instant messages. A lot of people drop out of school, um, get barred from going places because the stalker shows up to those places and is causing all these public disturbances. The stalker is trying to make it so this person cannot live their life. What are some things that you can do if you are being stalked? So some things that you can do if you are being stalked is to, number one, always write down when you see your perpetrator. When reporting an incident to law enforcement, always write down the officer's name and badge number for your own records. Even if the officers don't make an arrest, you can always ask them to make a written report and request a copy for your records. Well, absolutely trust your instincts. Uh, if you feel like you are unsafe or in danger, then you probably are. One of the great or most important things that we recommend is creating a safety plan. So that is your uh, plan of action when you run into this person. Know where you can go, who you can call for help. Uh, Start changing uh, your routine so that you're not always going to the same coffee shop every morning. The Stalking Resource Center at victimsofcrime.org has great resources about stalking. At school, you can talk to the Office of Student Conduct or to the school security. Another form of cyber stalking is watching a victim through their webcam on their laptop or their computer. Um, so to combat that, you can just cover the webcam with a sticky note, piece of a post-it note, so they can't see you.